The U.S. says it's carried out airstrikes in Iraq against a group called Qatayb, Hezbollah and others. But who are they and what does it have to do with Israel's war in Gaza? Qatayb, Hezbollah is an armed Shia group in Iraq that's backed by Iran. The U.S. says it and other groups have attacked U.S. troops and facilities more than 150 times in recent months. The U.S. Treasury recently sanctioned Qatayb, Hezbollah members, accusing them of assisting Iran's Revolutionary Guard. The group rose to prominence in 2007 with a series of attacks against U.S.-led forces in Iraq. It was formed by Abu Mahdi al-Muhandis, one of the most important military figures in Iraq. Some of the group's goals were to defeat ISIS, to expel U.S. forces from Iraq, and to establish an Iran-aligned government in Iraq. It's operated as part of the Popular Mobilization Forces, an umbrella of Shia groups which are recognized by Iraq's government and operate alongside the Iraqi military. In 2009, Qatayb Hezbollah was designated a terror organization by the U.S. and its leader al-Muhandis was killed in the same U.S. drone strike in Baghdad as Iranian General Qasem Soleimani in 2020. Qatayb Hezbollah's main backer Iran also supports Hamas in Gaza. The group says its recent attacks on the U.S. military are motivated by American support for Israel's war in Gaza and the continued presence of U.S. troops in Iraq. Iraq's Prime Minister Mohammad Shia al-Sudani condemned the U.S. strikes on Iraq as a flagrant violation of Iraq's sovereignty. More dangerous signs that Israel's war in Gaza is fueling further conflict in the Middle East.